Ah! 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 Again? Nine, no. But now your niece must come out. She must come out. What happened? Now she must come out and wrap all the pictures of me she took. Huh? Now imagine. She took your pictures. A picture of me where I was squatting and shitting inside the bush. Are you sure? Let her come out now. Call her out first. Chadika! 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 Come here. Come, come here, come and stand here. Come and stand here, no one this is going to eat you. What? What, what are you vibrating for? Okay, fine, catch him. In my face. You want to beat her up? Ah! Uh, Chadika, did you go into the bush today? Answer me! Did you go that direction today? What did you go there to do? I was strolling and taking pictures. You are strolling and taking pictures? Does the pictures include his own? Hmm? I'm asking you! Yes. Now, let's see. So it's true. Now imagine. It's, it's okay. It's okay. Imagine. It's okay. Yeah? She took the picture of me where I was just squatting and shitting inside the bush. Imagine you short. Yeah, and your face was crazy like that of a monkey. Very ugly. Huh? Will you, will, you, will you shut up? I'm talking about. Come on, let me see, let me see. Let me see, bring the, let me see the, the pictures. See, mm. now, see now. You really look nah, bad. Nah. Huh? You really look so bad in the picture. Now, is this what a girl like this should be doing to a man like me? And now, say, she has seen my shame now, and I demand to see her own. To appease me. Appease you. Uh. Uh -uh. You want her to strip naked? Is that what you are looking for? It's not going to happen. She must go inside that bush and squat and shit. Then I'll watch. Everything I see is left my eyes. She had to do that on gunpoint. Okay. Do you understand? Uh, now, come. Bring those pictures. Wipe out all those scenes. The, the places that involve you. Wipe them out. No tricks. Mm -hmm. See the picture here. Mm -hmm. See, I press option. Mm -hmm. See, delete. I've deleted it. Mm -hmm. There's no picture. Look for another one and delete all of them. See, all the pictures are bush, bird. No, not Okay. Uh, I'm sorry, what's that your name again? Ebel. Ebel. Ah, well, that is so good now. Ebel is supposed to be religious now. Your name is <coughs> in the Bible. Say, who is in your walk? Oh, don't fume like this. Eh? She has wiped off your destiny. Sorry for all the inconveniences. Thank you, oh? Sorry for Thank you, Nay. See ya. Eh? Thank your uncle. Tell that your, your uncle is the man we honor in this village. If not it, eh? Don't think we'll even stop me from making you to go naked. <laughs> yeah, right. You think I'm scared? Maybe I need someone to strip me naked. Hmm? After all, no one has done that in a long time. Huh? A real man, though, not you. You want to be stripped naked? Where is this one coming from? Now get me that camera. No! This is the ca I, 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 I can't no, give camera. I, I, I can't give I will, you I will, I will, I will, I will give you the camera. What is wrong with you? I won't you? give you the camera. This is the only thing I, I have here that. That, that helps me to chase away boredom for my sister. This village is so miserable and boring. I can't even have sex. All the men here smell of, of, of sweat and, and goats. Yuck! Ah! Your mother did not do a good job on you. In fact, she did not do any job on you at all. What is this addiction to sex? Ukulelewaku? Eh? Don't worry, I will marry you off to the nearest goat around. Or allow all the hill goats. To, 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 to book turn on you. I want to go back to the city. I don't want to live in this village anymore. Uh -uh. I can't stay here now. Stay with a man that farms and, and, uh, and just rents one he goes for, for a living. God forbid. I, I can't continue like that. Chadika, I agree. I rent he goes for good. It is not against the law. It is not a sin. I rent my he goes to those who have uh, 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 female goods. 
for them to cross and their female goats will get pregnant and have issues and it's an improvement in economy what is a sin there in your own case you want to go to city not even to go and get pregnant there and get something good out of it you want to do a bazaar with your waist that is what you want to do which is a sin no prostitution under my roof you know yeah no prostitution under my roof who is even talking about prostitution who is a prostitute one day you will understand me i'm talking about you good chadika send the seat here i'm going somewhere send the seat in now or you want to make love to the seat or you go Sex, 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 sex all the time. Who can ever walk up? I'll tell them to come and book turn on you. Hey, You owe me nothing. I owe you nothing. What do you mean? I left this my handsome he goat to impregnate your 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 she goat for five weeks, and you're telling telling me you owe me nothing. I owe you fuck all. This is not a real he goat. He couldn't mount any of the she goats. So meaning that this is a trick, not to pay me my money. Yeah, because it's my goats. I know their condition. How did you know this goat is not a real he he goat? All he did was. Eat, eat, eat all the palm fodder and shit up the whole compound, making the job very, very hard for the children to sweep up the compound every day. Okay. Now, look at the whole talk is finished. Because I am sure your he goats, your she goats, have, have been rushing it. Over using it, look at how little they have become. This goat just come on holidays. Enjoy itself. Don't tell lies against this living because this goat is dumb. Don't tell lies against this goat. He never mounted any of the she goat. Okay, you say he couldn't mount. God is looking at God of this goat is watching you. He's watching you. Know that. Okay, fine. So he did not mount any of your of, of your goat. If I take it to the backyard now, they will rush it. They will rush my handsome goat. I shall wear weapons to the back. Uh, they will. They will. They will. They will be disappointed. No, don't worry. Don't worry. He can do the job. Don't worry. You said there's no. No, come and show me the place. <laughs> Are you saying you put my he goat in the midst of all these things? Amadi, my goat is dead. Amadi, take the goat back. You don't have time to bring up the goat for No, what are you saying? You say? Okay, you are a very dishonest man. Look at that goat there. Is that not pregnancy? Is that not pregnancy? And you're telling me my, my, my goat did not perform? Look at, look at it. There are even two. There are even two. That one is pregnant too. Huh? Eh? I don't like this, dealing with dishonest people. Mom, Paul, I'm sorry I did not see those bonds before. Now I take your money. 5,000. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, okay, you're not a good person. Can't you say thank you? Thank you for what? Give you, me all this you should be telling me to thank Do you know how, how much you are, you are going to make of this? Thing? Okay. I'm doing all these things. Just to help all you right, progress I'll, in your good hand. I'm coming tomorrow. For what? Listen, listen, okay. Don't even near my house again to say that you want to rent that my good. Because I will not let you. I don't deal with dishonest people. Hey, we are friends. We are not friends. I'm coming tomorrow. No, no. If not that I can't tell you yeah, to see all these pregnant cats. Coming tomorrow. tomorrow. Coming tomorrow to do what? You can't talk to me, come to Don't worry, it is your son I'm going to you come to come and impregnate your goods.
know the she goat are barren. If that is the case, because I know the power of your man, your strength. Don't worry, I'll collect that money for you. But I will ask it for you. I can say you could not perform. Okay. How can you say I can say such a thing of you? When I can count, I can count the number of uh, issue goats you have made pregnant in this community. Eke doesn't want to give us a move. Don't worry, I will revenge. I know Ubin Abaroa. I know you. Who is that? Who is that? Who is that? Who is that? Wow! This is Here he comes. Very good. Our mouthpiece in matters like this. Yes. Matter is so far now. Yes. Good enough. It's fine. Uh -huh. What's going on here? Uh -huh. Huh? Uh -huh. I'll give you the name. These uh, local government people. Come on. They sent us some fertilizers again. Despite the fact that uh, the ones they sent before has caused a lot of havoc in this village. A lot. You see? So we need someone like you. Who can talk to them yes. about uh, this fertilizer issue? Yes. Yeah, we don't need this fertilizer. We don't need them. I thought we have finished with this thing. This matter has been sent to the Igwe before. We even gave a, 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 a report to the Igwe. Does Igwe know that they are here? No. no. Uncle. Igwe is not a savior in matters like this. He is saving his own skin and the being on their side. You know politics. He is afraid. That if he opposes the government, they may remove him and put somebody who may listen to them and get into the entire community and get people to also listen to them and pay the heavy fertilizer taxes whenever they supply us the small bags of whatever they put inside it. Whether shit or rotten vegetables they've mixed together. Mm -hmm. This is a goat shit. Our goats can provide enough of this. No need for it to give us all this. Yeah, you are right. Uh, excuse me, I have something to say. You must understand that the there is nothing you can you can say. We have said you have confessed. You com we complained. We went to Wigo and they complained. We don't need this. All this your exploitation. We are tired with it. Do you understand what you are saying? You cannot come here and you are taxing us. Your ten ten thousand. Do you think it's very cheap? All this your taxation and your exploitation. We say we do not want again. If you cannot come back, come down to, to, to the price of this very thing and then subsidize it. If not, we will not. Yes. Do you understand what I'm saying? We will not be able to buy it. Ah, fertilize. Come to think of it. Did my my great great grandfather, did our great grandfather, did they use this kind of oh, thing? We have this. This, land. this is more of poison. Yes. I'm telling you. You see that goat there? That is the only one I have now. I used to have them up to 17. Yes. What happened? You people advertise your fertilizer. That first time, you remember that first time he came? We spread it all over. The thing entered, he filtered into even the green grasses that our, 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 our goats eat. In one week, I lost from between 12 to 16 goats. For what? Because they ate the grass treated by your fertilizer. And you're telling me, in spite of that, instead of you 
you should be begging us. You should be begging us to take this fertilizer. So instead of begging us, you are not asking us, we don't need it. Even safe. All my yams are the body fertilizer. Go and look at them. Very strong. Very strong. Even in the bands, if you go to this, the ones planted with fertilizer, open the distance. They decay very, very fast. Yes, yes. Look, look, application is the problem. Is Tell me, how did you apply it? How did you apply it? Which kind of application? What application are you talking about? You come here and you exploit people. You, you are telling us about your local government chairman. Doesn't he come from a village? Let him go to the village and then put it in his own village. Yes. Instead of coming here to, to exploit us, yes. we don't need your fertilizer. Pure ED. Is it by force? Oh. Look, uh, uh, Mr. Wanko, I can see you are fomenting trouble in this village. Yes. I've had enough of My this. Yes. I will report you to, to, to the local yes. government. Who is the local government man that cannot even reason? Answer. In his own village, if he begins to tax people 10,000, 10, how many of the poor farmers do you think will survive? Oh, I don't know. And you're coming here because you're wearing yellow and black uniform. Yeah. You're trying to do it. In your own village, how many? How many people have you advertised, introduced to this? We don't, we don't want, we don't need your fertilizer. We have our dung sheet, Abi. Yes, right. We have our own local sources of yes. fertilizer. So we don't need this thing. This must stop this minute. Exactly. What the local government chairman is doing is a noble what thing. What is the local government chairman? Are you huh? personal in our... Hey, you will get one more. My friend, sit down. Get out of this place. Go, go, go. Let him go. I Let go. You must stop go. this immediately. Go, go, stop, stop, what? stop what? You should leave here. I still here. Stop, stop, I said leave here. Stop, stop. No, don't worry. Don't go. Wait for me. Wait, let, let me come. Don't go. go. No, don't go. Wait for me. Let him go. Where are we? No, I still here. No, where are you going? Wait for me. No, wait. Ununa. This nonsense that you bring. You bring here. Look, I imagine you the light Just yeah, 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 yeah. We have dealt with this in the yeah. end. Yes. Well, we say we don't need them. Ah, yeah. Is it by force? Ah, ah. Oh, ah. That's what don't need. Huh. Get that light on now. Government and win. Leave me alone. Get your dirty hands off me. What's, what's happening? Is that the man I sent you inside to arrest? My father is nowhere to be found. He is not in my house. My father? Oh, please, Wanko cannot be my father. He's my uncle. Your uncle? Where is your uncle? I don't know. Last I heard of him, he was outside brushing his mouth. Anyway, not brushing, washing. My uncle does not brush his mouth. He doesn't use toothbrush. And he believes that anybody that uses toothbrush would have his teeth falling off in the next 10 years. In this day and age, my uncle does not wear trousers. He still goes round this village in a wrapper. If you go in there, you would not even see one trouser. Bet me. Anyway, why are you looking for, for him? Why do you want to arrest him? Your uncle is standing in the, in the way of the government and fertilizer taxation program. Oh, oh, really? My uncle doesn't like the government. Reasons best known to him. But, um, maybe you should tell me a little about this. Fertilizer taxation program. I would rather tell you what your uncle has done. You see, for the past five years, government has noticed that farm produce has reduced tremendously. And farmers are not getting enough for their toil and their hard work in the farms. Yes. At this rate, if it continues, there will not be any food for people to eat. Exactly. It's so terrible. And this is simply because they do not employ the use of modern farming techniques. 
especially the use of fertilizer. And because of this, the local government introduces noble initiative of giving out fertilizers at subsidized prices for a very meager amount of money. You can get as many bags of fertilizer as you want for your farms. But do you know what? Your uncle is standing against this noble initiative. He's doing everything to stop farmers from buying this idea. Can you imagine? He tells them that the fertilizer is not good for the crops and that actually poisonous to the crops. And he goes to tell them that the government is charging so much and for this reason and many more, we are out to get your uncle. Um, you know what? Give me one second, okay? Just one second. One second. Oh, my, 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 my
Samantha, sir, you are the best core member we have in this local government. That's why I've come to you this evening. With all due respect, sir, I'm really flattered. Thank you. Good. I wish to recommend you for this year's call member award, which comes with a car, a reward of 250,000 naira, and a powerful letter of recommendation from us to you, to any company in this country in which you seek employment after your youth service year. And should you want to stay back with us in this local government, we'll be glad to offer you employment as an official in the local government. Thank you, sir. Thank you. All these are all we have in stock for you if you win this award. And this is what you must do if you want to win this award. I want you to get this man to give us a permission to use his picture for our farmer's cooperative almanac. I understand this man is a local influential man in the village. He is of high repute and he commands respect. If people see him in our almanac, they will know that he is with us and our policies. Please note, I equally understood that he is not a rich man and he is primitive. He is as stubborn as a buffalo. He is uncouth. No finesse. In fact, he is a primitive man. Can you do it? I, I think I can. I will try, sir. But first, I'll need uh, little bits of information, details um, of him, the government policies in his community, why the policies were made, the benefits to the rural dwellers, etc. Stuff like that. Well then, no problem. Be in my office first thing tomorrow morning. A private car will be arranged for you, some money for your transport, and a booklet containing my stewardship in this community.
Seriously, sir. How do you expect these people to pay tax? The entire roads to this village are messed up. Gully erosion, bombs. Jeez. Is this not a local government or is it a state road? Whatever it is, sir. These roads are in need of urgent repairs. If I was a pregnant woman driving on this road, I'll be talking about a miscarriage right now. Hello? The line is... The, the line is breaking up, sir. Service is poor and in the next 10 minutes, as I'm seeing, if I continue driving on this road, I'll lose service on my phone and be completely incommunicado. Hello? Hello? Hello, sir? Hello? Oh, Sorry. Hello. I'm looking for one call for Denu village. Uh, how far is it from this village and his place? I'm sure she has gone to inform him of the presence of a strange woman who's asking of him not so. Is that how much people like him here? Please, please direct me. I mean him no harm. I will move. I'm a woman, see? A beautiful one at that. I'm here to marry him. Won't I make him a good wife? Mr. and Mrs. Mwangwo, please, please direct me to his face. Thank you. Left. Just enter there. Okay, yeah, okay. Bye-bye. Okay, Thank bye. you. Thank you. Bye. Don't forget to call for my wedding, you know. Okay, I'm married to one call. Bye-bye. <laughs> agent from the local government sent to your uncle. My name is Samantha. Friends call me Sam. You must be Chiadika. Thank you! Thank you! Okay, so where's your uncle? The government people want to put him in prison, not so because he chased their officials away with a court last. No, not anymore. The government wants to make peace with him. They sent me to make him our friend. They sent me to tell him that. Where can I find him? Can I see him? No, he's not at home. Where is he then? How do I trust you? I don't know. I just gave you your camera back. Do I look harmful? A certain photograph of his has generated the interest of the local government chairman. We want him to sign and give us permission to use it as the face of the local government farmers' cooperative almanac. In exchange, government is ready to give him a bungalow in the city, set him up in any business of his choice. Really? He better be taking me to the city with him because I actually took that picture. Really, you did? Yes, I did. Wait, are they going to give you a price? No, oh, why not? I'm sure they can. If you convince him to give us his permission, 
using the picture, you know, in our almanac. Of course, I can convince the chairman to give you something. It might be a small price, though. What? Why do you need a signature? You can use it. You don't have to ask him. Listen, my uncle is not that educated. He doesn't even know his right. You can use the picture. I, I took it and I'm giving you the permission. Government does not want to do that. They want to do the right thing. They do not want to trample on people's rights. You know there is an opposition party and its candidates. We need your uncle's permission. Okay? If we don't get his permission and the opposition gets to hear about it, they might approach your uncle, tell him about his rights, get him to sue or even sue on his behalf. And that would be wrong. Very embarrassing for the government if they have to settle out of court and all of that. No, we have to do the right thing. Okay. Oh, that's it. against you, no one is going to bother you henceforth or try to arrest you. I come on behalf of Mr. Baka, the local government chairman. Um, I have a good proposal for you, sir. Is that going to break her? To spoil my mind. Yeah, because this is the right thing. The government has to do it. I don't even talk to her. I have the most important of the city. Do you understand? Wait, get her out. You don't know why she came. Please, you can get her out. Oh, oh, hold wait. on. Please, wait. Oh. How did you get this? Uh, from my local government chairman, sir. Um, we want your permission to use the picture in our farmer's cooperative calendar. We will sell it. Raise money to further subsidize the fertilizer for the farmers in the community. That will also help boost agriculture, sir. Who did this? Huh? Please, uh, it, it's not her fault. Our, our officials who came here to arrest you, they, they seized her camera and they found the picture in it. I don't know who you are, but I don't care to know. I don't know why you are here. I don't even want to know. But please, what I want you to do now is to leave my house. No, sir. Did you say no? I said, come out of my house and you say no, sir. No, Uncle, Uncle, please. Listen to her now, please. Please. Shut up. You're the cause of all this nonsense, the very first instance. If you hadn't brought this rubbish, would we should be here? I drove three hours to get here, sir. I, I want to, to sit down and talk to you. All I ask is that you listen. You drove three hours? Yes, sir. And I'm sure you passed through a road to this very Uden. Does the road you pass on show any sign of government presence here? Did, did you see anything that shows you that government is interested in the Uden community? It's only when they want something, they come. Tell government I'm not interested. The only interest government wants is they come here, they increase their tax, they take tax from almost everybody, even almost the, 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 the little kids themselves. Bring fertilizer for us to plant. We cultivate with the fertilizer. Why do we carry the proceeds so if we do not have good, proceeds, uh, uh, good roots? And yet they said they, they, they need a present. They need me. They need my picture. That's the only time government will run three hours through that road to come here. Listen, leave my house. Will you shut up? Listen to her. You are the person who started this nonsense in the first instance. Look at, look at, look at what you want to take of your uncle and you want to sell it for public to know to see how naked I am. Get out of my house. If you don't get out, you will regret it. In fact, if you do not, it, I am going to carry you myself and dump you outside. Lay your hand on me. You, you, you regret you ever met me, sir. What did you say? Don't, don't, don't! Ah! Don't! Put me down! Is that what I'm Put me down! Oh! 
I leave my compounds. Uh, Have you not realized that I am a man of my word? Like I said something, I do it. Opportunity. Now enter this scene and leave my place. Uncle, Uncle, this is not fair. You don't put your hand on a woman like this. It's so wrong. It's not fair. You don't put... Shut off. You caused this thing in the first instance. It was that your camera? That... Where is that camera? I'm going to seize it. For the next three weeks, you're not going to touch that camera or see it. Man, what are you still waiting for? I'm looking for my keys. Your key. Your key without key. Come on, get out. Get, get, carry this one out of my compound. Government. Sorry. And you. What are you still doing? Eh? Come on, get out. Get out of the house. Pray, mantis. And if you could continue to bring problems. <laughs> What do you want from me? What do you really want from me? To talk. I just want you to listen to me. My name is Samantha, Sam for short. I studied to be a social worker in the university. Currently, I am a youth core member attached to the Ajinaka Local Government Council. I was sent to ask you to please give us your permission to use that special photo of yours, you and your goat. This is a lemongrass tea for you. Oh, okay. I hope you like it. Uh, Put it soon, be ready. Uh, then you can use this to cover yourself so you don't feel too cold. Thank you so much. Thank you. So we just we just want your goodwill. Since you have so much influence on all other farmers in the community, I mean your picture on a almanac will mean that you're on the side of government. I don't want to be on the side of government. I don't want to do business with government. Do you understand? So I think it is best when you for you to tomorrow you go back and tell the to me, government is like leper. You have a, sh a handshake with them, you get infected. This man sitting here does not want to get infected because government have dealt with me enough. I was in the army, they disgraced me out of the army, he did everything. I took it in good face. Now I came to this very village. What does government want with me again? This is not about government, sir. It's about the people, the farmers, the rural dwellers. Rural dwellers. That's what people call us. They refer to us as rural dwellers. Illiterate bush people that do not know their left from their right. But I think it's government that does not know its left from its right. There's no sort of name they did not call us. I have said... I have divorced myself from government. Don't you see how I dress? You see how I do this thing? They tried to frustrate me. I came back to my village. I want to start another life. My own way. I don't care the way I dress, the way I move, what I do. My life is my own. I don't want to be influenced by government. They have influenced me enough. Politicians will come here and say all kinds of nonsense. I, we don't have water. We don't have hospitals. We don't have all the amenities. Even the ones our neighboring communities have, we don't have. And yet, politicians will come here and campaign. Bring us bags of rice. 
share it among the rural dwellers. We will eat and then vote for them. What happens? They go to that very office, they forget you. Not only forgetting you, they make you poorer so that by the next election, you will be hungry enough to canvas for that their rice. And they bring it and you vote for them again. I have said, me, Okonkwo, I am no longer interested in government. I am divorced with government and all their dealings. What has government done, 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 done for me? What has government done for this community? So why are they sending you? What kind of influence do they think that you can get for me to work with government again? Please. We are very hospitable people. <coughs> if not, I would have asked you the moment you came when we were doing all those things to go. But I did not. Because it's the character of this community to accommodate visitors. I accommodated you. It is not, we are not hostile. Rather, we are hospitable. You understand? That's why I'm sitting here with you now. My niece, you can sleep in her room. You can feel as comfortable as you are, as you want. But tomorrow, I'm going to go back to that very good government and tell them no show. What they ask you to come and get for me and my good. Why wouldn't government be interested in a photograph with me and a Cadillac, a big car, for instance? They want my photograph with a goat because I am a goat, a semi goat. It's all right. Tomorrow, go and tell them that. It's no game. They say you're an illiterate, an original bushman who just charges forward like a buffalo and acts without thinking. I accept. How wrong they are. You are not what they say you are. You're very intelligent. Now I know why your people respect you and hold you in such high esteem. Thank you for your compliments. But I hope this, your uh, compliment is not going to influence our agreement. Tomorrow, you go back to the government and tell the government, I don't want them. Okay. Okay. Them go be your close friends. Uh, Chadika. When they need your help. Chadika. They use you, them go throw away you. Now him they vex me past. I don't vex. Imagine yeah, people will expel me. Okay. And then get the food ready. I want my friendship. I beg go na be lepa. Anyone where she go na go carry. I want to carry na wahala de go. So my uncle refused to give his permission. What does he want? Does he want us to rot and die in this village? Wait, did you tell him what the government is ready to reward him with if he gives his permission to use the picture? No, I did not. Your uncle is not the kind of man to be swayed by promises of money and life in the city. He's very strong in his beliefs and grudges against government. So, 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 so he's not thinking about me. What about me? Hey? Don't I have a future? Or does he think my future is tied to that fan work he does? Hmm. Hmm. I, I see, I, I will run. I will run. It's just that I don't want to hurt him. Because I know he's still mourning his sister, who is my late mother. If not, I would have run since. Chadika, I will run. Chadika, it's a good thing you did not run away. Please stay and continue to beg him. Maybe he will change his mind about the picture. Let me return to the city and tell those who sent me here how my journey went. I will come back if they want me to, okay? Uh, please, please buy me chocolates when you're coming back. I've missed chocolates. I will. <laughs> Bye-bye. Hey, These people gave me a dead car. Imagine. I think it's a battery. What is it? Oh. Oh.
This guy cannot start you. Huh? The problem is not from the battery. Somebody put salt in the engine oil area. What? Somebody did what? Honestly. And if you continue starting this car, the engine will knock. You need to get a mechanic to drain the oil completely and flush the engine. Then you put a fresh oil. And I cannot do that now because I don't have the tools and oil. You need to tow the car to the city. Oh, what do I tow the car? I don't know, Auntie. Maybe if I get to my shop tomorrow. You no, know, today is already gone. Look at the uh -huh. time. Then I'll take a bike to the to the city and get a mechanic. Um, do we, uh, so, so how long will that take? That is tomorrow. Tomorrow morning everything will be okay. Uh, do it now. Uh, do it. Auntie, I will need money for that. So you're waiting for money. I don't have money. I'll give you. Just go. Go and do it. Just go, go. Which means two extra days. Is that what they're telling me? So you're going to spend a total of four days here. Salt. Salt. Chadika. Chadika. Chadika, why? Why? Why what? <clears throat> Don't come from that angle. Don't even try to deny it at all. I know you. I know what you can do. Chadika, what did you put into this woman's car that made the car not to start? I don't want silence. I want you to be answering me. If not, I am going to summon all the three, three tiers of, of, of uh, spirit government. You are going to swear by Amadio Hafez. After that, you swear by the Bible and swear by the Quran. And you know you're finished. You will die. Okay, ma? So start telling me the truth now. Did you or did you not? I did it. You see? <laughs> I like this auntie so much. I don't want her to live just yet. I just put little salt on your engine just to delay you. I didn't mean to spoil your car. I'm sorry. You are a devil. Chadika, you are a devil. You know that I'm allergic to shit. And then you brought a bag of shit and insist on tying it down to my, my, my compound. You couldn't I thought you were going to be better than your mother. Who was a clear freelance prostitute jumping from one bed to another in the city? Wanko, stop! Oh, Peter, stop again. <laughs> Let her go. Did you say this? such a thing? Why would I say such a thing? Who knows who is waiting for her in the bush? And by the way, what are you asking me? After all, you are the person who brought this thing into this family. Me! Without you, would we have been uh, going through all this the hassles? You are asking me, me. Because, please, I don't know whether Samaritan or Samantha, whatever your name is. Whatever bond you think that is holding us together, correct? Leave this compound. Before I vent my spleen on you, pack and go and leave my family alone. Biko. Me. 
What are you doing here? I want to try and see if I can find Chiadika. As what? As her mother or as an interested party. As an auntie. Eh, from overseas. Who have come to, 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 be, to love uh, my niece more than the uncle. Look at you. I have said leave this place. Don't touch you. I will succumb to your pressure. Leave my, myself and my family alone. How will you put yourself on a family that does not want you? Why can't you be nice? Why are you such a hard-hearted and harsh man? What kind of uncle tells his niece that her mother was a prostitute? You have just proven beyond a doubt that you are very harsh and hard-hearted. Wherever that girl is now, she's heartbroken. She's in pain. She's in sorrow. Why don't you just try and be nice? It might be difficult, but it doesn't cost you anything. We better go and find her before she does any harm to herself. Ah. Thank you, advisor. You are advising me on how to control my family. Do you understand? I have told you to pack and go. If you were not here in the first place, would uh, 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 I talk harshly to my, my list? If you are not in here, who's trying to wish you to go to the engine? This is its problem. Leave this village. Go back to this place. Take your bag. Don't let Look at you. You think I want to stay here? Yes, you want to you stay here. You think I want to? I'm happy wearing this one outfit. Since two days, you think I'm happy wearing this one out? Yeah, I like it. I am tired. I want to leave. I'm sick and tired of this village. Tired of being blamed and dragged into your domestic problems. And most of us sick of wearing this one blouse and this one jean. And what one? What? You said one you, uh, 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 jeans and one top. So I completed it for you. And what one? So you even like women? And you say you are a revolutionary. Revolutionary, my ass. I'm not interested in your big grammar. I've asked you to, to, to go. I'm not interested in knowing the meaning of your big grammar. If you spent more time in school, instead of fighting development, you would have known what the word revolutionary means. You think I planned it to stay here? I would have brought a whole box of clothes if that was my plan. I brought one night out to spend one night here. I'm tired. Sick and tired. I'm all sweaty. I'm coming inside. You should have told me that you are coming inside. In fact, if you have got the complaint to me, I would have shown you to the street. You go there and then take your bath. Clean up. I can lend you my wrapper. So you use it. You can even tie it and wash these ones until they are, they are, they are dry. Instead of coming here to tell me you are coming inside here. It's yes. not my fault. But Excuse me, Mr. Wanko. My private are not your business. Oh, so my own private. It's not. It's your own business. It's the business of government. Yeah? My recruit is, is, is your business. The whole rank and file of my family is your business and that of the government. But yours is not mine. They want me to come and stay naked and then take my picture and show the whole world because you people are doing a calendar. Go and tell them that I will not succumb to your, that pressure. You, here, if I ask you to remove your, your, your dress now, not even to take any photograph, okay, will you do it? Just ask the two of us. Will you do it? What, what are you, why are you looking at my dress? I'm what are you looking at? I'm looking at What are you, why, why? Why? I'm, 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 it is against the law to look at your dress. What's your dress made of? Is it made go of that way and look for your niece. I'll go this way. As what? Go and waste yes. your time. You are looking for crime more than the grief. I'm not. 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 I'm even when there is no hope, it can't be like no biggie. My can't imagine Chicago. Never you give up. Even when there is hold up, come what may. There is hope. As long as there is land, there is hope. Whether in the village, even in the city, wherever you are, there is hope. Whatever you do, there is hope. Chi, she, she's not crying. Please, don't mind your uncle. He just has a very bad mouth. He did not mean what he said. Hmm? How can he call my mother a prostitute? Okay. Ah, it's Samantha. Look at me. Do I look like the daughter of a prostitute? No, you don't. You don't. Please, dry your eyes. Eh? Come on. You know what? Come. We'll go and look for your uncle. I will make sure he apologizes to you and takes back his words. Okay? Come. Dry your eyes. Come. Come this way.
<laughs> Excuse me. Have you seen one? Well, yes. What they call Lilanya Diggy. You don't have to lose hope, even when there is no hope. It can't be like no biggie. My carly, my gee, Chicago. Never you give up, even when there is hold up. Come what me, there is hope. As long as there is land, there is hope. Whether you know. I told your niece that you lied about her mother being a prostitute before she died and that you only said it out of anger so I want you to tell her that you lied tell the poor girl that you lied and apologize to her are you going to do the right thing or not or you're just going to remain in your foolish local pride I refuse to apologize because you think that apologizing means accepting defeat or it makes you seem less than the local champion that you are. No, surprise me. I don't know. Come on, come on, sit on my legs. Yeah, wouldn't it? Oh, go. No, I'm okay. He's calling you, yeah? He's calling you. Come, uh, madam, get us pepper soup. Three plates of pepper soup. Sit down. Thank you. I lied about you. I didn't know it. It was out of anger. That's why I said that. What? Sorry. Oh, why is it that you always mention prostitutes at the slightest provocation? The other day you said that it is not a sin to go to the city, but prostitution is a sin. When I asked you who is a prostitute, you said you would tell me one day. And today you told me that my mother is a prostitute. <laughs> is there something you're not, you're not telling me? <laughs> I don't think I said I'm sorry. It's out of and I apologize. You know, I am short tempered. And when that temper comes, I just open my mouth and then let the steam out. It's not that I meant exactly what I said. No. I will never ever No, no. Chica, come on, sit down. When God decides to remember you, He can pass through anything. Your stubbornness could bring you to where you think you will never reach. God might even get you a friend who could lead you to your destiny. Do not judge the present with the past Because it's God that holds your future oh. There is hope Anywhere you are There is hope Wherever you are There is hope There is hope You can't sleep Yeah I saw you sneak out of the sitting room You thought I was asleep But I wasn't You look sad and troubled would you like to talk to me about it mm -hmm. there is nothing to talk uh, i'm okay there's no this i didn't sneak out anyway i just uh, decided to come outside there's nothing to tell you can talk to me what do you want to be to here? story of my life there's nothing interesting about story of my life i'm listening fine i was a soldier uh I got recruited uh, when they came here looking for people who are going to uh, enter them. I think I was the only person in this village who went for the selection. I was selected, though with my person six then, person six certificate, first school living certificate. I went to the army, uh, I stayed there six for, for four years. I was dismissed from the, in the army, I came back home. 
Uh, that's not too much about my life. It's not. Uh, mm. Interesting. Okay, you were talking about. Uh, you mentioned you were in the army. Tell me about army, privates, and recruits. I thought you were joking. Oh, you thought I was joking? No, 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 no. I was not joking. No. I was a military man. Well, what really happened was that I went to the city and uh, got married. But when they sacked me and I had to come back home with my wife, and then started farming ever since then. Wait, well, wife? Did you say wife? Oh, yes. I was married. So when they sacked me, I came back home. So I decided to do farm work. But unfortunately, my wife um, ran away with uh, one man who came to do on a rural water project in my place. My wife ran away. <laughs> Probably she saw something better in me. And that was since that time I died inside. That woman killed me inside. Later, I even went to the police. Do you know what the man had to do? That was even the bad part. He went to the city and he was telling them that uh, my people were pursuing him and all that and all that and all that. I went to the city to defend myself. They did not even believe me. In fact, I died since that time and now. Wow. No wonder you have many reasons to hate the government and the city. I mean, your, your military experience and the engineer you took your wife to the city. You see, the, 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 the worst part. My wife, unfortunately, died in the man's hand. Mm. And he had to remarry. Mm. The new wife started maltreating Chiadika. And I had to go back to the village and bring her back. I mean, to the city. Why? She's not your daughter. Couldn't her engineer of a father protect her from his new wife? It's like you're not following me. I don't understand. I married. Uh -huh. I came back after they sacked me from the army. Uh -huh. Came back with my wife here. My wife saw a man and followed the man to the city, taking our four-year-old daughter to the city. And that daughter happens to be Chadika. What? Yeah, she's my biological daughter. No, you, you have to tell her so that she feels that she belongs here and that she's not a total stranger. You have to tell her. Tell her. So what am I going to, 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 to give her as a reason why the mother had to go and run, to run away with her? With her, with her another man wait is that is that why you called her mother a prostitute is she, was she not was she not and i don't want her to to go to 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 to, to that line well there, there has to be a way for you to tell her without revealing what her mother did oh no wonder no wonder the bitterness and everything oh i'm really sorry so i should tell you that next time when you want to pass judgment you don't pass from a distance Get closer to the person before you judge. Sorry, sorry, I'm sorry. It's okay, it's okay. It's okay, it's alright. Why are you looking at my breast? Me looking at your breast? I saw you looking at my breast. How can you accuse me? Let's not accuse me. Looking at your breast for what? Why would I be looking at, at your breast? To me, to my this is it's not even real. Like your hair is not real. It's my hair. Your fingernails is not real. They are real. That I know you guys from from the city. You said, sir, I'm looking at your breast. But I know that you people even go and buy this, what you call wonder brazier, a wonder bra, take it to pop the thing on. Is that what I should waste my, my time on? Mr. Iwankwa, please do not disrespect me. Please, please, I am not your wife who left you. Don't pour your anger on me. You cannot even be. My wife was original, even though she was not original in certain areas. But I, is, rather than look at you, why would I, do you know you have insulted me? And you're turning to, to say I insulted you. To say I was looking at your breast at this my age, I have some natural uh, 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 breasts to look at. They can even show me for free. Even your buttocks, as who knows now, it might even be artificial. Let me tell you, you cannot come and accuse me of looking at your breast and expect me to just just uh, leave it like that. But if rather than go for your kind of listen, I will go to the village and find the original one. The sort of people thank you very parts. much, Mr. Wanko. Thank you so much for the insult. Yeah, you are insulting thank me too. Thank you. Thank you. You hear? Thank you very much. Now I know why you uh, you deserve everything that you got. Your story is sad, but you deserve everything. The engineer needs to steal your wife a million times over. Thank you. Tomorrow I'll leave your house. Thank leave, you. Leave. I didn't ask you to come in the first instance. Looking at your breast. Looking at your breast. You are. You are. Oh.
To the garage, not bringing the garage. In case. Uncle, I will do as I like. I will do as I like because my life does not begin and end in this village. I will do as I like, or you sign that picture and then we'll go to the city and leave. Who's going to sign the picture? You! So you can go to the city and leave. I can see every part of you is vibrating for the city. I know what you are looking for in the city. It's not job, it's not prospect. All these things look at you, your chest is shaking, your backside is shaking. Because at this very age, they can move. Let me tell you, people are going to parallel beat you until you die. You don't know me. Oh, oh, let me tell you something. Let me tell you, this boy is not a village boy. He's not a village for you. He just came to stay with his grandmother for holiday. Okay. He saw me, he said he would take me to the city. Okay. I will run away with him. Oh, you think you can spoil my life? You cannot spoil my life. If you don't allow me to run away with him, I will stay here, I will get pregnant for anybody I see, and I will bring you shame. Okay. Yes. So, this is foreign material. You imported it. Eh? I'm not surprised! I could sign the picture! You can eventually go and you, your mother was carrying her own on a saucer, like Kola Not, and sharing to everybody who cares, who has a penny, and get what So I'm not surprised! That's why I'm not to come and sign this picture! You don't know whose house you are going to. Let me know. You don't know whose house. Your father should be ready. Leave me alone! Yep. I'll kill you! Your father should be renting you like I rent my head dog. He goat. Do you understand me? Your father should make money from you. Rent you to all these barren women. So that you can impregnate them. You! Come to my house. You know that? Keep on. Open your head. Keep on your head. I'll kill you. I'll kill you. Now you can get on your side. Look! Open. Leave me. Leave me. Your father should be right, right to out to bury me. Look, leave me alone. I don't know. I don't know.
I was about to send a search party to look for you in Udenu village. You sent him to a goat, sir. I would have been surprised if you thought of him anything better than a goat. There is governance for you. You meet all manner of people, good and bad. Did he sign? No, he did not sign, sir. Sit down. You mean he did not sign after I had told him all the goodies you have in store for him if he signs? I did not tell him, sir. Why? <laughs> sir, he's not the kind of man to be swayed by such offers. Did you try? He wouldn't even give me a chance. He found every opportunity to badmouth me and the government. The man has his own personal problems. His daughter running wild on him, past love issues, career disappointments, all of that. Then get prepared to go back there. Please, uh, no, uh, you, you can't be serious, sir. I really dislike the man. I, I can't stand him. He's insufferable. He's annoying. Is that the kind of report you want to be in your file in this local government that you felt? No, sir. Then get prepared to go back. You can take some more clothes, spend more days, we'll get some more money available for you for inconveniences, in as much as you get results. Yes, sir. Sam. Sir. That man in the village is just a man. You are a woman. Use it. I want you to produce that he good because he's causing catastrophe in this community. No. Call him! This boy will put me in trouble. Within this little time he comes for holiday. King! Eze! Eze! Come here! That is the bingo. Okachi. Be he is cutting eye for the girl. I'm going to report him. Look at him. He's blowing whistle with his mouth. King, did you go to his house? Eh? Nama, with your auntie. Asa, he frequents my house. I'm asking you, did you go to his house? You don't want to answer. He comes to my house. I want now the lady has him. I can tolerate anything in this community. But for him to be coming close to this girl is dangerous both ways because I can finish him. You understand? I have just come here so that tomorrow when you hear that I did this, one girl did this or did that, you will know I have, I'm justified to do it. That was why I... Let me see how you people will be cutting eye. This boy comes to my place. I am not surprised that he is doing this. Because you know your first daughter. The, the, the mother is the same thing. The mother, your daughter, I'm not ashamed to say it, was carrying her own like a saucer. Sharing it to everybody in the community. Do you understand? But this boy is solemn. If not, you have to take care of this boy, yo, or they will turn your place into a maternity. The way I see him, he's on fire. Give him a body, yeah? He now answers king. King with the identity. Come on, guys, a queen. Warn him for me. Oh, but this is your manhood. Everyone, this is your phallus. 
Imo menana. Come to my house. Anything that happens to your manhood is your fault. Do you understand? How about you go me a wussy and you Come on, go. When you did you go to his house? I'm asking you, did you go to his house? What, 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 what does that guy think he is? What does he think he is in this village? Some sort of local terrorist. Please. I'm asking you, did you go to his house? No, I mean, this guy is crazy. He's mad! But did I tell you he fought me when I went to his house? He fought me! I respected his age. I swear, I would have given you a bit of his assistance. Don't go to his house. Don't go to his house. Ada apante yata. Oda anuife. Even the government people are, are begging him to be their friend. He refused. The story is all over the village now. The government has even sent him a wife to beg him to be their friend, and he refused. Please. Is this such a man you want to challenge? Eh? No. Instead, you caught your holidays with me and go back to the city. Mama, Mama, can't you see that that girl is gorgeous? Can't you see she's pretty? Who would go to his house again and again the way I intend to be doing? Hey, Mama, Mama, let me tell you, if that man doesn't want me to go to his house to see this girl, eh? Myself and that beauty will choose another place we'll meet. You will not. I will. Uh -uh. Mama, that is how to find a wife. Yes. Mama, I'm not of age to get a wife. Am I not? Next year, I'll be out of university. I will get a job. What is the next thing? I'll get married. What else? Oh, he thinks that nobody will stand him in this village. He thinks nobody can stand him in this village. Okay, I will stand him. Tell my uncle I said, I will stand him in this village, no matter what it is. After all, this is my maternal home, and nobody can harm me in this place. Please, my son. Please. Let him wait for me. I'm coming to his house. Son, I'm an old woman. No, you are, you are, I was anywhere because you are, you are, I was anywhere because okay, well, I'm a big. I want you to produce that he goes because he's causing catastrophe in this community. No. Call him! This boy will put me in trouble. Within this little time he comes for a holiday. King! Eze! Eze! Come here! That is the bingo. Okachi, be careful. He is cutting eye for the girl. I'm going to report him. Look at him. He's blowing whistle with his mouth. King, did you go to his house? Eh? Nama, with your rent. Asa, he frequents my house. I'm asking you, did you go to his house? You don't want to answer. He comes to my house. I want, not the lady has him. I can tolerate anything in this community, but for him 
to be coming close to this girl is dangerous both ways because I can finish him. You understand? I have just come here so that tomorrow when you hear that I did this, one girl did this or did that, you will know I have, I'm justified to do it. That was why I... Let me see how you people will be cutting eye. This boy comes to my place. I am not surprised that he is doing this. Because you know your first daughter. The, the, the mother is the same thing. The mother, your daughter, I, I'm not ashamed to say it, was carrying her own like a saucer. Sharing it to everybody in the community. Do you understand? But this boy is solemn. If not, you have to take care of this boy, yo, or they will turn your place into a maternity. The way I see him, he's on fire. Give him a body, He now answers king. King with the identity. Come on, guys, a queen. Warn him for me. Oh, but this is your manhood. If ever, this is your phallus. In moment, Come to my house. Anything that happens to your manhood is your fault. Do you understand? How about you go me a wussy and you Come on, go! When you keep me in Give me a sign, sign, you Huh? Did you go to his house? I'm asking you, did you go to his house? Mama, what, 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 what does that guy think he is? What does he think he is in this village? Some sort of local terrorist. Please, I'm asking you, did you go to his house? No, I mean, this guy is crazy. He's mad. He... But did I tell you he fought me when I went to his house? He fought me. I respected his age. I swear, I would have given you a bit of his existence. Don't go to his house. Don't go to his house. Aba apante yata. Oba anuife. Eh? Even the government people are begging him to be their friend. He refused. The story is all over the village now. The government has even sent him a wife to beg him to be their friend. And he refused. Please. Is this such a man you want to challenge? Eh? No. Instead, you caught your holidays with me. And go back to the city. Mama, Mama, can't you see that that girl is gorgeous? Can't you see she's pretty? Who would you go to his house again and again the way I intend to be doing? Hey, Mama, Mama, let me tell you, if that man doesn't want me to go to his house to see this girl, eh? Myself and that beauty will choose another place we'll meet. You will not. I will. Uh -uh. Mama, that is how to find a wife. Yes. Am I not of age to get a wife? Am I not? Next year I'll be out of the university. I will get a job. What is the next thing? I'll get married. What else? Oh, he thinks that nobody will stand him in this village. He thinks nobody can stand him in this village. Okay, I will stand him. Tell my uncle I said, I will stand him in this village, no matter what it is. After all, this is my maternal home and nobody can harm me in this place. Please. Let him wait for me. I'm coming to his house. Son, I'm an old woman. No. Okay, okay, 
Hello, welcome. I'm back. There was no one in the house, so I thought I might as well tidy up the place. How was your outing? It's good to see both of you go out together for an outing again. Okay. All right. Oh, he came back. Too. I thought you abandoned me. Oh, actually, how are you? I'm fine. Just my uncle's usual trouble. Mm -hmm. Hey, you saw that day now that he embarrassed my new boyfriend. Don't you remember the day you left? Mm -hmm. hey, today again, he, he took me to their house and warned their grandmother to tell him to stay away from me. Really? Yes. Anyway, there's enough time for that. Huh? We'll talk. Come, mm -hmm. see what I got for you. Oh, you left your bag outside. There was no one in the house when I came. Have you forgotten? Okay, I'll just help you. Think. All done. Mm -hmm. I hope you like it. Ah, chocolate! You didn't even open, open it to see what's it. I know, I know, Papa Chocolate. Thank you. <laughs> open it. Open Thank it. You have opened this, Papa. You like it. Are you so ah, ah, ah. Bag inside. <laughs> open the door. Look, there's an unwanted visitor in my house. And I want her to leave this village for good. Is it the government wife we, we heard about? I thought they said he did not want her. So she, she has not gone still. Government wife? Which government wife are you talking about? We heard that the government went and uh, paid her bride price and gave, the, gave her to you to marry so that you can be their friend. Uh -huh. That's what we heard though. Ah! Village rumor. There is nothing that they cannot say in the village. And the thing is that their rumor spreads like wildfire. Little bit of fallacy, little bit of false, a little bit of lies, and all those things. And wait, I wait, 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 are you saying that the government did not send any wife to you? Ebel, I am not here to discuss what the government, whether the government sent me a wife or a concubine. I am saying that I have a ton in my flesh that somebody I want to be scared out. In fact, I want people to, you people to scare her in such a way that she will not ever think of coming back to this day at all. I'm sorry, but sir, just what exactly do you want me to do? Now, tomorrow I am going to send the Chiatika out. In fact, almost the whole day is uh, distant. I will make sure she's not around. Me, I will be around, but I will be, I will be hiding. Carry about uh, three boys, organize about three or four boys, you know. Maybe you mask yourself. Come to, the, to that, my house. It's only her that you get. Scare her, scare the living daylight out of her. That you want to begin to move out immediately. Oh, Tiara Nudelu! Consider it done. In fact, as I'm talking to you now, hmm? I'm even seeing her now running away from this village. Mm -mm. Running away? Ah. Isn't that one what you want to? If she runs, this little girl with a vehicle. She came with a car, and the car is in my back in my house. If she runs, I don't want you people to make her to start from there, begin to run away. Because if you run, she, she's going to come back for that hacker. I want you to scare her to the extent that she would say, okay, fine, now I'm leaving for good. She'll go into her car, pack up her, her swag, and then leave this village. You know this, the kind of scare you're going to give her now. Scare her enough. Man, you can go. Can you do it? Consider it done. Fine. So whichever way it will be to come, I will aid you along the line. Yeah? Now, let me drop. No, don't worry. After the job, I'll come for you. Yeah, I'm not going to take the, the you are taking the food away. Take the washing. I'm coming now. Let me finish this chocolate. I'll move it. I've been the one moving the That thing you are taking will spoil your teeth. Hmm. I'm telling you. This one I'm taking. Do you know the last time I took chocolate? 
Since I came back from the city, I've not seen chocolate so cook more of eating it. Only this small one will come and come. I will advise you to concentrate on eating our local food. They contain raw food. Forget this chocolate. Except you want to spend your whole day in hospital. Go and ask God as you want to have I bought these for you from the city. Uh, you brought it for me from the city? Yes. So why are you just giving it to me now? Since you came back. I was waiting for you to finish your dinner. I wanted you to use them and, you know, wash down your dinner. I wish there was electricity. I would have preferred you had it, you know, chilled. You would have preferred. So what you are insinuating is I should be doing what you prefer. You are not ordering me in my house, so gradually this is how it's done. Please, Mr. Manko, every little thing I say to you does not have to make you upset. Huh? Thank you very much. I'm not interested. I prefer my pan wine to this. Ah, uh, Uncle, this is a gift now. You don't reject gifts. Can you reject it? All right, let me have it. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. I also brought you uh, multi mm. if you don't mind. That's so thoughtful of you. He needs it. The government married a woman and sent the woman to me. And uh, that is the rumor. What? <laughs> what do you mean? What, what, what is that situation for? As if you are you too big to be my wife? No, no, no. Are, are you saying you cannot be my wife? I'm too little for you. Is that what you're. Your, your... Can you remember the things you said to me? You said my hair was fake, my nails were fake, my breasts were fake, I put dunlop in my buttocks. Thereby making everything. Can you remember all those things you said to me? Yeah, I remember all those things. But those things are bad. If they tell you now to be my wife, won't you agree? Don't you have, you know, have you not been caught an eye even in my back on me? Can you, after saying all those things to me, ask me to be your wife? And you imagine that I want to be that, other than do the job I was sent to do here, get you to sign the documents, giving us permission to use your photograph in our almanac. Are you saying no? I'm not Good night. Said to you at all. Cool. Um, tomorrow, I'm going to send you to Akukala's place. It is very far, but you have to go there. My ego have spent more than one week there. So when you get there, you get me 2,000 naira from Yes. Look, you have sent it this in. I'll send this one. The washing person mm. send it to you. I'll send it. I'll go, I'll go. This is my uncle there. Like it too much? One call. Hello. Who's there? Oh my God! Who are you? Who are you? Please. Step up. Please don't hurt me. Please. Hurt you? Did I hear you say hurt you? We cannot hurt you. But the chief priest of our world, Sarah, is going to hurt you. That's right. So you are going to use it for sacrifice? No, yes. please. What? You know, strangers are good for sacrifice. Oh, please. I, I, wait for Mr. Wanko to come back. I am his visitor. Please, just just wait. Wait, you can't use his guest for a sacrifice. No, 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 no. Please, no, I'm Wanko's wife to be. I'm his wife to be. Where is his wife to be? Please. 
shit, you can't do this. Why don't you wait and you ask him? Ask him! Why don't you ask Wangwa, please? Why don't you wait for Wangwa to come? Wait for his to come! What kind of process is this? What is it with this? You cannot, you cannot uh, uh, carry a woman. You are asking me to remove my hands. Huh? We are spirit people. My will like it and normal. You are spirit people. Look at the way you are trying to lift her. You are just lifting the Anybody ask you to go and lift her and press up. Fuck lift. But now you are the one that sent us to come and scare her away. Huh? Why are you now doing this to us? Is it good? Scare Sit. her away. Did I ask you to come and scare her breast away? Look at the way you are putting, you are putting your miserable hands under her and lifting. Is that how, how to lift? Huh? Now remove all this nonsense on your face. You think I'm joking? What do you mean? Look at the you Remove this thing and I'll run back to your home. Now. I thought you people are sensible enough. Run home! Naina, who's why now? Naina, who's why now? Naina, who's why now? Naina, who's why now? You were on the ground, I lifted you. For you to even sit, not to stand. He said, Naina, who's why now? I will bury you, that's the next thing. When will you leave these things all changed? Look at this, Dr. Go, go away! Hobo, all changed. All changed. Ebe, Ebe, is it me that you're, you're, you're looking at that? Ebe! <laughs> My dear wife, I had you when you were telling them. Oh, no, 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 don't kill me. I'm his wife. I'm, you see, you never told me what was your young You're unbelievable. <laughs> I never knew you loved me like that. <laughs> see, don't worry. You know, if you had told me, come, ah, an open invitation, you want me to come, you say it, I'm coming. Honey, honey. <laughs> So you came out to sit down. So you sent people to molest me. Why? I want to stay. You want to stay as what? To do what? I want to help out in the farm. I'm, I'm really, really trying to like you. Even though you hate me. Is that the new techniques? That's what they taught you. You soft words on him, you know, and soften him. You know, women's semantics. It doesn't work with this man. Go and tell them to teach you another style. It doesn't work. I don't know what you're talking about. No one taught me or told me anything. I'm speaking from my own mind. Your mind is hollow. Your word is hollow. To me, there's no soul in it. Even if there is soul, I'm not interested. Tell them to change techniques. This man is not interested. I know you're still hurting from what your ex-wife, Chadika's mother, did to you. And it's natural to carry forward that aggression to every woman you come across. Sometimes it still pays to accept new friends. Give them a chance. Santana or uh, Sama, whatever your name is. Is it because of the smile I gave to you back there? I was mocking you. That is called mockery. I'm not softening. Go and learn another style. This style is not working. You're not acting it fine. I want you out of my company. When God decides to remember you, he can pass through anything Your stubbornness could bring you To where you think you will never reach God might even get you a friend Who could lead you to your destiny Do not judge the present with the I got you, I got you, I got you Got you, I got you Hey, die, 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 die I got you why are you quarreling with that you shop? Why are you quarreling with those Why well, What's wrong? Am I not doing a good job? Good have good you job. got to the farm before? I'm sure you haven't. You're not working well. Am I not? I'm working. Look, I'm Wait working. Wait till let me show you how to do it. You see where you're hitting it. Yeah. You don't because you waste all your energy. Go down here. There. Cut all these ones. You don't even need to hold anything. Okay. Then it can remove all Instead of cutting one, one and one after the other. <laughs> Yeah. Make sure that you get the whole thing. Okay, okay. Do you understand? Okay. Mm -hmm. Use your energy and do it. Okay. Huh? I'm pregnant. Hey. Uh, are you taking permission to go? You know, everywhere is toilet here. Yes, I want to go inside the bush. Go inside the bush or outside the bush. This is God giving latrine for everybody. So inside the bush, outside the bush, all of them are the same. I won't be long. I'm coming. Samantha. 
Okay. Bye, Daddy. God, beware of snakes, so. I will. Okay, follow me. Hey. Can't you raise your knife? What are you ah. doing? No, listen. When you want to cut, that's not the way to do it. This is the way you go to hold your knife. What is this? Blisters. Mm. You don't come out now. It's okay. It's nothing. I'll have to get used to it. I have to get strong in a local kind of way, especially now. That we are with local people, bush people. No, uh, complete it. I didn't mean it like that. Mm -hmm. I didn't. How do you Anyway, mean? I'm glad you said that we are friends. It's nice. It's really nice. No, no, no. Friends as in friends. It's not uh, that kind of, not friend like friend. What am I talking about? Let's walk, let's walk, let's walk. Can I hold you? Hold me. Yeah. Before we finish, what kind of hold you? Mmm, you're smelling, man! Man! What is, what is this? What is this? Family of all. Jail of all. Go and walk. If I don't walk again because of these blisters, come. What should I do? Just sit, stand there and watch me. You know that. You see, you see the blister mm -hmm. that I'm telling me about. I want to cut. Oh. Why? Oh. Yeah, it's cassava this morning. Yeah, it's apple this morning. You know what they call apple in this village? It's cassava. It's not in my mouth. <laughs> I know, I know. But Lala. what's the essence of saying I love you when I can't kiss you like that? Mm. Yes. Apple is my No, go get. See, even if I kiss you, it will smell in my mouth. It will not be the kiss is the sweetness of my kiss. I don't you know that the sweetness of the kiss is the sweetness of the kiss that commands the most to keep it. Don't you? Yes. You like it? You like it? Yes. I'll, 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 I'll say it. I'll say it. I mean, the, kiss, the, the sweetness of the kiss is the sweetness of the heart. Complete it. The sweetness is death. Oh. That is what you're looking for. So, this is the toilet that you told me you were going. I'm impressed. You have to pass out a whole man. What a lump of shit. I just, I just saw him now. You just saw him. He was doing commercial America Wonder. He jumped ninja. Papa. No, leave me. Leave me, leave me. And you. You dead. No. You get to come to my district. What is going on here? Stop it! 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 Stop I think I don't see the way you look at her whenever she turns her back. Yes, sir. No! 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 You know a lady like that, you come to the house. Hey! You, you don't just do it hide hide. Come to the house and go her respectably. Yes, her uncle will fight, but you'll be tired. And then he'll let you sit out, talk to her in the open. What's your name? Um, my name is King. King? You want to kill the future you know before you even have a chance to marry his niece? Give me the cutlass. If you want to see Chantika, I am officially her auntie, so do as her auntie says, okay? Go, 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 go. I'm sorry, auntie. Good, go. Go, 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 go. Thank you, auntie. Oh. 
when a little girl who does not know anything about farm work goes into farm work, what does she get? Blister. We used to own a farm when I was little. In my village. I ran away. Hmm? You ran away? Yes. Because I didn't want to end up a farmer. I wanted more for myself. So I ran to my auntie in the big city. She took me through primary school, trained me up to university stage. My father and my brothers, they stayed back in the village. Ow! Ow! My brothers are married now with kids. I guess they too are happy in their own way. Yay, that means I'm not alone. No, you are alone in your own pursuit. In her own, she ran away from the village into university. You, you are trying to run away into Kenk. So that the king can mess you up. After messing you up, you will continue with your circle of running. I'm telling you, listen, why don't you cool your head? Read your book in this village. Pass your entrance into university and see whether I will not help you to run away into university. Chadika, that is a challenge you should say you have taken up. Okay, I've taken it up. Uh -huh. Good. <laughs> it's not as if I don't. I love education too much. I didn't have the opportunity myself. Sorry, my dear. Mm. You see, if I had been educated up to, let me just say, even up to secondary mm. school level, I would have ended up a senior officer in Nigeria land. And now you should be issuing people orders instead of receiving these orders mm. from people. I would have been more comfortable. So who doesn't like education? Oh. Anybody, sorry, sorry, my dear, sorry. Anybody around me who wants to go to school will always be encouraged. So I'm asking you, I will encourage you, I will even, my last kubo, I will spend it if you really want to school. Sorry. How? Sorry. Sorry. Next time, if you want to go to that very farm, I'll give you uh, from this dollop material, remember? So that you can, yes, wrap it around the head of the, of the machete mm. before you, before you land mm. it. Sorry. Hey, you're so delicate. I'm not delicate. You are. I'm not delicate. <laughs> What is this? This go or jogging. If you want to jog, go to the road. Good morning, Mr. Wankwa. Morning. Good morning. This is not the place for jogging. Would you like to join me and keep fit? Join you? Yes. In jogging? Yes. A retired soldier? Don't challenge a retired soldier. Jogging? Let's go. I'm ready. You want me to come and jog with you? Yes. Okay. Let me get my shoes. I'm here waiting. Oh, <laughs> oh this I've got to see. Nothing. Look at my dress. No, nothing. Look, I was one of the best dressed men in those days. And yet my wife left me. So, who am I dressing for? No. Let us go. Are you ready? We go. One, two, no. one, two, one, two, one, two.
Dragon is good, you know. It makes you keep fit. I remember my army days. I was one funny adjutant to me. Used to have that time. He will come and join us in jogging. Ah, that man. After five minutes. Yeah. He will join up in jogging. After quaffing a whole load of beer. This man will join us. I will continue to jog. After 20 minutes, this man will be panting like a horse. Mm -hmm. I will talk, huh? Why would this? He said, no, he wants to catch his breast. Very funny man. At a stage, he will just sit down. Like this? Uh, just as I'm going. Okay. And then he will be panting. He will be panting. Mm. I said, why would this man come and join us? Then, he will quaff beer again. The next day, he will come and join us again. After by like uh, one second, he will start panting like a horse. One second. Uh, I'm just trying to help you out. You know the time keeps diminishing. First you said 20 minutes, five minutes. Nah, one second. Is I'm trying to tell you what's happened to my commandant. You know, like it's me, that is breathing. This man is a senior officer who is supposed to live by example, but he's panting. He's panting. Not, you, are, you are not panting like that. No. I said this man will come. It's my time we want to where to live. It's okay. We saw okay, get up. He said no. Mr. Wankwa! Yes, sir. Are uh, you starting to breathe like a horse? You oh, start you breathing think, like you a horse. Lies? No, not at all. If you dare challenge me, you will die. We go. Is this a challenge? Mm. Okay, fine. Let's start by warming up. We have already warmed up. No, second phase. Okay. We have first phase. We have second phase. Okay. Ah, yeah, that man, he will delay us. First of all, you say one, two, one, start two, gradually. One, two, 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 one, I wish I was light. I would have laid under the fan till it was time to shower. That is one of the things we have to tell them in that very city. That we pay our electric bills here. And yet, nobody gives us light. I will tell them. I will tell them. I will tell them. The, uh, Chadika! Chadika! The, the, probably this girl has gone out again. See? I've not seen her today. I've not seen her this morning. What kind of a problem is this girl going to be? It's her age. She will go the stage. I hope she has bought the university entrance examination forms. No, she has no, not. Uh, but I've uh, given a message to the village postmaster. As soon as the, the form comes out, he's going to bring me one. If this girl is ready to read, that's my problem. No, you're not such a bad guy after all. You can be nice if you want to be. Guy. Do I look like a guy to you? Okay, sorry. Nice. I tie up now, and that is why I tie up. I don't want anybody to regard me as a guy. Okay, nice man. Can I now assume that we are friends? Friends? Why do you keep hammering on this friend, 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 friend? We walk the opposite sides of the street. Where is a gay young girl who has finished the university and is doing your service. I am a local man now. I have totally divorced myself. From any to know Ibo. I'm living my life the way I want to live it because of what happened in the army. Tell me how these two people can how can we how can we relate as friends? Oh, we can we can have good conversations, talk about different things. You can, you know, help me, you know, with things I'm focusing about the village, and I'll help you with the city. <laughs> you want to you tell me about the city? Uh-huh. Is it because I'm tying this wrapper and I'm dressing like this? 
you have forgotten that I came back from the city. I had been in the city for some time. Do you understand? What information can you tell me about the city that I don't already know? Okay, let me ask you honestly what I broke contact with information from in the city. One question. There is one program. Uh, Ichuk. Do they still televise it? Uh, the one that contains uh, Loma Jugoji. Those are the things I want you. You will help me to talk. Loma Jugoji. Who's that? <laughs> hey! And you say you're going to give me information about the city. Because I feel one question. Ask me another one. There is no one that I will ask you that you can answer. Fine, let me leave that branch. Let me come to sports. Eti Messi. Is he still playing for Nigeria? I don't know if he still plays, but I know him. You don't know him? I know him. He, he's one of the greatest footballers this country ever had. When I said play, you automatically know that it is football. So oh, don't bring that trick. You think you're smart. <laughs> See, the information I want to ask you about City, you don't know it. So why are you thinking that you are going to give me information with cross-pollinate information? It will not work. This man that is sitting here has been this day. In fact, in former cities, because I was there when uh, during the Supreme Military Council, when they were creating states, mm -hmm. I was there when they were even drafting our constitution. So I know about the city and even forming of the city. You understand what I'm saying? These are uh, even do what you do, this thing you do, what do we call it here? Uh, National Youth Service Corps. N NYSC. I, I was there. I followed my adjutant the day they were uh, drafting the uh, the uh, national youth service or something. I normally go with my yoga. We we'll go even the supreme military cards when they're having their meeting. They say, so anything about the city, I know. There is no one you cannot tell me. I know about the information of what you are doing. So you know what's happening. You know what time it is. Of course. You see, that, that is why your heart belongs in the city. You belong in the city. <laughs> Why don't you just, you know, sign these papers, give us permission to use your picture. The government will reward you with a bungalow in the city and the rent paid for five years and then set up a small business for you. I also, I'll be rewarded with, you know, the prize for the best youth corps member of the year. We'll both be happy. We'll remain friends. Even the farmers in this village, they'll benefit a lot. When the calendar is sold, government will use it to buy fertilizers for them, which will be subsidized. They'll pay less for it when they want to buy. Please, just Please. give us permission to... So, all this running around is for me to give you my picture. Being friends, cross-pollination of information, is just for me to give you my photo. If you don't give your permission, they will say I failed in my assignments. Now you talk, you should have come straight instead of going telling me we will move information, I will be friends and all that. This is the main objective for me to give you permission for my photo. Okay. Welcome. Hey. Welcome. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Then, in my house, under my roof, look at my house. So you had the infantry to come to my house and then be strolling out of my, my, my parlor like with double and then telling me good afternoon, sir. Uh, uh, uncle, uh, uh, what have I done again now? Eh? What you have done? You were here when auntie, auntie said I can come to the house and see her. I'm shouting. And auntie told you. Who's, who's, which auntie? We weren't doing anything. We were just inside her room, chilling out, that's all. Chilling out? Yes. Chilling out under my roof. You are in her room. Try to catch them and go out. So they have started chilling you out for you to chill them in. So under my roof, you people are chilling out and in. With bravado, Bemo. No, uh, Uncle, uh, Uncle, it's not like that, oh. Well, you were here when Auntie Sam said I can come to the house. Instead of seeing her outside, I'll come to the house and see her. Boom, I'm shouting. You see the mother? She gave you permission to come and chill my daughter out. You, 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 you,
What are you Next time, let me see you in my house. What are you And you? You? We're, not, we're just inside. There was nothing happening there. You want to get pregnant? Who knows the number of chilled meats that you have inside your stomach now? We're not doing anything. We're just, we're just sitting inside your room. Not even to, to, to live, living with the power. Look at you. Only to be a button. Why are all your bottles broken? This is how it is. That's how it is. Do you want to get pregnant? You can't. Because you have been shouting from the one that you need sex. Ojibia, Ojibia, Ojibia. You need sex. That's what you have been shouting. And now, under my list. No, you want to stop it. Stop it. Do you want to kill your child? You want to kill your own daughter? We do it. Did she lie? Please tell me the truth. Are you my father? Please. You need to tell me the truth. Are you my biological father? Who am I? Who are you to me? Whose child am I? The engineer whose wife malfitted me in the city or you. Please tell me. Please. She spoke the truth. I'm your biological father. But I don't understand it. My mother is your sister. So how is it possible? Oh, you have to tell me. No, no. No, no, no. You're not going anywhere. No, no. You have to tell me who my father is now. I want to know. I want to know how. I want to know how. How, please. All right. You want to know? Yes. Your late mother is my wife. I married her while I was in the army. We were living together until the army discharged me or dismissed me. I came back to the village with your mother and you. That's why we were in the village. Your mother met an engineer. They came for a water project in the village. And they ran away with him. Taking you along. Well, unfortunately, your mother died. And the engineer remarried. That was the woman who was maltreating you in the city. I got wind of what was happening there, the maltreatment she was giving to you. So I went to the city to bring you back. That was how you came back to the village and started staying with me. Everybody 
in the village know what happened, the story. But I decided to hide it from you because of um, I didn't want you to go through the emotional trauma. And I'm sorry, I thought I would have told you in a better, at a better time. But unfortunately, you have to find out the way you found out. Your mother was a beautiful woman, but very promiscuous. See, that was why each time I see you talking about men or getting close to men, that fear comes in me. I try to protect you so that you don't follow the footsteps of your late mother. I'm sorry. Jesus! I don't want you to follow her footsteps. I'm so sorry, I'm really sorry. Have you seen what you have cost? Are you happy now? Are you happy that you are about to, or you have destroyed my family? <laughs> you can now gloat. <laughs> Let me tell you. Before noon, tomorrow, I do not want to see you or anything like you, or anything like any property that belongs to you in this, my compound, or else. You really have to stop threatening me, you know. What is wrong with a young girl falling in love? You, as her father, you should guide her instead of criticizing her. Okay. Uh, it slipped my tongue and I told her her true parentage. But I've done you a favor. I've taken the burden of telling her in the best way off from your neck. And as for you threatening me to leave tomorrow, it's not even 12 noon yet. I'm leaving immediately. She deserves to know who she is, who she really is to you. You can choose to love her and care for her or give her the rules that she needs to stand. Or you continue to be overbearing and abuse her. Okay, but one day she will look you in the eye and tell you what a bum you have been. A bomb man who lived a bomb life carried her into a bomb existence. Refused to embrace positive change and give her the change that she needs when she had when he had the chance. You know I don't blame you. Oh I was the person who gave you the chance. Oh Nobody here tells me how to live my life. Nobody tells me this is my village, it is my life. You have come to ruin it. See, I'm really, I'm really, really sorry. But if you ever need to leave this man here and come to the city, as for Ajinaka Local Government Secretary, as for Youth Corps Member Samantha, everyone knows me there, okay? Knowing the kind of man that he is, he won't even give you money for soap. This is for your soap and toiletries. It's 10,000 naira. I'm sorry, I manage it. I, will, I have to go. If I'll, I'll kill him or he'll kill me. I'm really sorry. Keep your money. Nobody needs your money. Give her, give her the money. Come and take your money. Nobody wants your 10,000. Jesus. Jesus. No. 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 to get away from here. I just want to go to a place where I can get fresh air. Somewhere different from this place. Away from all this that has been happening. Listen, I, I, I just want to make a future for myself. My uncle said I cannot go to the city except I pass my jump examination and then go to the university. So tell me now, how will I live with him when I know he doesn't like me? He hates me for what my mother did to him. How can I stay in the same house with him? It's okay, alright? It's okay. I mean, you have me. And I have you. That's the most important thing. Alright? I mean, let's take it one at a time. smile for me, okay? At least I'm here with you on my knees. It's a full lonely lanya. What they call it lanya day. You don't have to lose hope. Even when there is no hope. 
In my life, this is the worst point of my life. Won't you? Oh, Jamaica, this is where you are. This early morning, huh? You are stopping with your feet on the ground for me. I have gone to the army. Where have you gone? Huh? You know how much I hate this off. Whose only objective is to have access to, to your ties and probably tear your cleavage to shreds and then run away. Uncle Wanko, you have no right to say such things about me. You have no right at all. You denying father. No, no, no. Stay away from me. Let me tell you how much of a denying father I am. Let me tell you how much of... In fact, I will vent my spleen on you and you will know. Look at you. Instead of doing something useful with your, with, with your life, follow your granny to, to your grandmother to, to, to the farm. No. You want to farm on top of my daughter. A man me. I'm telling you, see, see, it's not because I'm running away from you. It's, look, I'm not a local champion like you. Let me tell you. D see, don't push me this man. If, if you push me, I'll make you vanish from this village. Ah, uh, what's that? You're not a local champion like yes. me. Yes. You're an international champion. Yeah? You're international. Work for me. Two alternatives. It's either you go back to the city and begin to, to, to dance there until you have been dancing there. Or if you choose to stay in this village and not comport yourself, I will kill you with my own hands. It's a promise, I need to Look at you. You are not a local uh, uh, man. You are international. International puppy dog. Get on your chair. And you. Let me tell you, let me make it very clear. I have vowed nobody close to me again is going to run to the city with a man. Ajul me Ajul. Do you understand? I said no to it. Look at you. And you, you are talking from a distance. I thought as a man you should have come back. Instead of you helping your grandmother to farm and make good use of your life, you want to do your own farming on my daughter. It's not going to happen. And I would let it happen. Ona. Come on. Ona. Come on, get home. You are coming. Look at the hungry thing that you have gone to. Because that thing in the budget in his, his pocket cannot be something useful. This kind of nonsense do not, instead of you getting close to somebody who is useful, who has been useful, known in this very village, you went and then you get close to an imported culture. You don't have ambition. You. I don't blame you. We have a free, a very free ties. I got out of free. Next time, next time this kind of a thing repeats itself, I will divorce your head from your body. Thank you for you. Come here. Come wait for me there. I said I'm going to You failed again? I did my best, sir. I'm sorry. I'm totally disappointed in you. 
I would have sworn that no other person could have done this better than you. This little assignment. Anyway, there's no recommendation for you and certainly no awards. Yes, sir. Come in. Good morning, sir. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Sir, it looks like our friend in Udenu village has been up to all this chief. A young man in that village on holiday came today at the police station to report that Mwampo has been pursuing him with a cutlass, threatening to kill him if he ever stepped foot in that village again. They saw Mwampo? Yes, sir. What about the boy that came to make the reports? He has come back to the village. I ask him to leave immediately so that Mwampo will not have the slightest suspicions he came here. And I suggest we make an early morning arrest. That is, if you agree with me, sir. Exactly what I was going to say. I want him arrested first thing tomorrow morning. Our men must leave as early as 4 a.m. in the morning to catch up with him while he's still asleep in bed. I think it's time for us to put him to order. I have changed my mind. Sometimes force is the best method when dealing with an animal. Diplomacy, you know, is for human beings, not for animals. Well, well, uh, Miss Amata, Sir. you can go home. You've done your best, I guess. Maybe I underestimated the stubbornness of Papushima. We will lock him up. Yes, sir. So, I... trouble. They're coming here to arrest you. Listen, did I not tell you not to show your face around this visit again? You thought I was joking? Why don't you just listen to me, Mr. Wango? We may not be best of friends, but I know you and Chedika too well to bear seeing you in jail. Okay? There's fresh trouble. The local government police is coming here as early as 7 a.m. to arrest you. What kind of fresh trouble? What did they say he did? I think that boy King, he came to town to report to the police that your father wants to kill him and has been pursuing him around the village with a cutlass. So they'll be here as early as 7 a.m. You just have to leave. If you have to spend the night here, you have to leave before 7 a.m. Okay? So, that boy has the audacity to go to the town and report to me to the police. Which is, are you staying or you're leaving? Like you're coming back from the city. Oh, yes, I'm just coming from the city. So, what did you do next? Um, well, I went to the police. I had to protect my life first. Now I told them about your father's threat to kill me. Ah, so it's true. So, you went to report my father to the police. This boy, you're wicked, though. It is king. You're very, very wicked. Very wicked. What do you mean I'm very wicked? I mean, do you want your father to come in here and kill me without anybody deterring him? Well, it was just a domestic issue. You did not need to report him at the police station now. Eh? 
Okay, okay, tell me. How will I love you knowing that my father is being locked up there? How will I love you? Charika, my life is not a domestic issue. My life is precious to me, even if it's not to you. Eh? Yes. Is that what you're saying? Uh -huh. Okay, I will not see you again. Don't come near me again. Stay on your own. Stay on your own. Fine. No problem. Yeah, if you say so. Eh? Hmm? Fine. Fine. Huh. Hey, my, my father told me, oh. My father told me that you're no good for me, but I, I, I did not believe him. Hey, you know what? I, I know I'll find love someday. Fine, no problem. Is that what you want? No problem. Yeah. I mean, it wasn't as if I got any no kiss from you. It was always, no, not time. I don't have the time. No, no I don't, I'm not in the mood. I don't want this. I don't want that. I'm starving. I better go back to the city where I can get some red-blooded chicks I can roll around with. Instead of staying here, having high hopes on you. Mm. Getting cock and bull stories all the time. Mm. Mm. That's what you're saying, Abby. Yes. That's what you're saying. Mm -hmm. Ciao. him that we are not living here without him. We shall be here and await his return. We are stocked in supplies. <laughs> we are going nowhere until we arrest him. We can't go anywhere. Take your camps. Did <laughs> you say anything about me? Because I deliberately left my car there so that they will know that I'm the one that came to one one walk. I don't agree with this his arrest method. Did he say anything about you? But he just said that they are prepared to wait till any time he comes out from his hiding. But my place is very small. Though. In case you need a place to pass the night, just come over. Don't mind them. They are just stopping. We'll leave before night. Well, we wait here now. We wait till night for. Uncle, are we going to pass the night here? Why don't you go to that your friend's house? The one that came here in the morning and said that we should pass the night. Mm -hmm. That's the wrongest place for us to go. Don't you know that this people will be watching my close uh, relations and their friends now? They'll be watching the very, very good. It will be a very big risk for me to go join them in that place. I'm even thinking of uh, equal members, my mother's. Uh, Place that is uh, my hippos. I rented my hippos to the Kalyan in the village. How far? Not so far, but very, very safe. Let us go to the Kalyan. Chi? Chi? Welcome. Welcome. Tell me that this your goat is worth 2,000 naira per week. I had paid for two weeks. I gave your daughter 2,000 naira the other day. Did she give it to you? Uncle Kale, I said that the services of my goat has increased. It has increased. We are removing the subsidy. Listen, I've been subsidizing it on the waste of your goat. I have removed it. I charge now 
two thousand naira a week because he's doing more than even through his job. Oh no! You can't pay me that one, 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 one. Huh? Why are you too hard on this your business? I want for. Huh? Why don't you allow your one penny to fall into another person's hand? How about you last night with your family? Knowing fully well that you have a police case and that they can even come here and arrest me as an accomplice for abhorring you. What is greater? What is more than that, Wango? What is greater than that? Why are you insisting on collecting your last cobble from me for the service of this your ego? Why, Wango? So, Akokalia, are you telling me that you are now charging my one peer to refer to you? For staying, for abhorring me, and Akokala, this is a family, this is a community, and you know what to do for them. If there is fire in one person's uh, 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 heart, you know all of us are going to point that very far. Do we charge the person, or if even a million That's why we are staying in this area. Now you are charging me for staying in your place. So this is a hotel now. Hotel de Akokalia. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> hotel de Akokalia. They will then fine. I will accept it. Let all the money I'm owing you take it from the services of this thing. I know that she has serviced you and you're you're good very well. Take it. No problem. I could call him now who work that you have me. So we are going. We can no longer pay for hotel that call No more! What is the matter? Akukale said Nami Sabi. Nami Sabi. Because I tried to, 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 to take the, the, the money for renting my good thing. Akukale man is charging me for harboring me, us, one day. Akukale want to take that. I asked Akukale. Akukale said Nami Sabi. So we're going. Okay, why don't you just give me permission to use your picture? I will use it to bag it for your freedom. Why are you still talking about this picture? Are we still talking about it? Yes, we are. Just give me your permission. Please. Father. Father, please. I don't want them to lock you up in that prison. Just give them the permission to use your picture for that almanac. I just found out in my son. I don't want to lose you. Just shut. Please. How do you think I'll feel knowing that you're going to be in that prison for God knows how long? I'm going to go through so much pain. Father, please, if you're not thinking about yourself, think about me. How will I stay alone in this village? I'm doing this for my daughter, not for the government. Okay. I'm doing this partly for my daughter, partly for you. Thank you so Fine. much. Fine, you can use the picture. Okay, fantastic, yeah. good. But I have a better idea. Oh, okay. Because I know my good, my good knows me, we are poor together. Mm -hmm. So we can give you a better pose than that thing that you Okay, so what idea do you have? Um... He's a teacher. Ask this man if he can rent us good because I don't want to put it in for him. He will always charge you. If he can give us two ties, then I'll give you better clothes. Please, please, Mr. Kukalia, do you have perhaps two matching ties or closely matched ties that we could borrow? Okay, we'll pay you for it. Of course. I don't need your money. Huh? Okay. If it is, if that is what you need, I'll give it to you. Thank you. I don't you. need your money. Thank, thank you. We have been paying you for everything. Okay, good, good. This is really good. Thank, thank, you. thank you. Thank you so, so much. So what I want to do this okay. so that my wife can wear it. Okay. Well, okay. Well, okay. Well, well, okay. For me and Chapter, you can do anything you want. You don't have to uh, lose it. I have the professional photographer. There is no hope. It can't go like it. No, 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 no. Makani, Mami, and Chica. Never you Jump give up, yeah, yeah, yeah. even when there is hold up, come what may, there is hope, as long as there is light, there is hope, whether in the village, there is hope. in the city, wherever you are, there is hope, whatever you do, there is hope, never you give up. Your stubbornness could bring you 
to where you think you will never reach. God might even get you a friend who could lead you to your destiny. Do not judge the present with the past because it's God that holds your future. Oh. There is hope anywhere you are. There is hope. So, my men have just arrived with Mr. Wango. After spending a night in that village, they arrested him alongside the female cop member whom you sent earlier on assignment to get his approval for the picture we wanted to use for our Almana project. She has gone earlier to warn him. My men reached there, they didn't see anybody. Surprisingly, this morning, they all came back, surrendered the man, Samantha, and his daughter. Bring them in immediately. They are outside with the security man. One minute, sir. Where is Samantha? Good afternoon. She had gone to the disciplinary committee to obtain a clearance. So, you are the one who Yes, I, I am the one who like uh, you put it. Uh, I was persuaded by uh, my daughter and uh, Samantha that uh, I should uh, give approval for these pictures. In fact, my daughter Chadika took some other pictures. You know, show, uh, 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 show them. You see, my wow. daughter Chadika took all of them. They are fantastic. This is fantastic. That's what I've been saying. It's even better than the one we had before. Exactly. What about the release paper? Release paper. Okay, the paper they gave me, I told them that there was no need for this. I gave it with all my heart. There was no point uh, signing an approval or release. You can take it to do anything with it. Good, good, good. You have even signed for us to use the almanac. Mr. Luke, so, this man is free. So, uh, just like that? Yes. There shall be no further harassment on this man. And I'm wondering why he's, he's, he's even uh, After all, even your, your boys were so cooperative. When we surrendered ourselves, they even allowed us to go and uh, change uh, our address. Why are you saying just like that? The promise of a bungalow for five years and the cash reward of one million naira will be made available for him to start a little business. Sir. Please, be free. Um, now that they have given you the approval, can I go? Yes, you will go. But before then, please, I would like to show you the bungalow we have rented for you for five years. I came here and willingly, because of the cooperation that we have been given and receiving, said, Take this. Why should I not take your house? Neither do I need the 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 money that you need. I'm with you. If you people say you are bringing development or that my picture on the Amanak will bring development to my community, I'm all for it. I will even receive kudos for it from the members of the village of the community. Since it is going to bring development like you promised, unless you people have other things in mind, not to bring the development. Because if the development is coming and they, they said it's because of the pic, my picture on the almanac, it's the credit is not going to me. Because now if I take the money, it means I've been bribed. If you people backslide on your promise or take your house, they have the government that bribed them so, sir, it won't be well with my conscience. I would like to go back, keep whatever, provided you promise in the rap Provided you do it, take the thing free. I'm not uh, accepting anything, sir. I just want to go back. Well then, let him go. I'll personally arrange my driver to take them back to the village. But eventually he decides to change his mind for our offer. Be made available to him in two global Please get them released 
at the police station. Are we free now? Are we released now, sir? And take this picture and download it. Okay, sir. Let's go. What do you feel my just about this thing? Do you already say that we should believe? What do you say what for? Your daddy. Is it possible? God forbid. Good afternoon, sir. One call. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. I'm looking good. Huh? Thanks, thanks. How are you? Well, I'm fine. Just uh, the way you left me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> still doing my farm work, trying to make ends meet, and uh, still renting my one champion Hugo. Mm. You know that Hugo is something now? That it's in folk. <laughs> in fact, my Hugo is in folk. I'm sure, but be very popular among the students <laughs> around this village. <laughs> Thank you. This is big. You're welcome. Well, you brought another fertilizer. Yes, yes, yes. How yeah. much is this one going to be this time? I know it's a cut through since things are changing. Well, yeah. uh, it will surprise you. It was for this that uh, you came. Why did you? What of that? Uh, the like I said, it's for that reason that we came today. The local government chairman asked me to greet you. He sends his warm regards. He holds you in high esteem. Yes. Uh, this time, the, uh, the fertilizers are free for the whole community. Free? Free, You don't have to pay anything for it. All you need to do is gather strong young boys to offload the fertilizer and you distribute it to the village free of charge. The local government chairman told me to tell you that this time he's giving you a job because he believes in your person. He a job? Yes. He believes you are the only person that can supervise the equitable distribution of the fertilizer to the whole communities in this village. And that is not a small thing. You see, he trusts and believes in you. Please, he is ready to pay you 75,000 naira per month for the next eight years while he's in his two-year terms as a local government chairman. Before you say anything, Wanko, this is not free money. It is a job. And if you refuse it, that means you have not served your people. And it also means that you do not have the interests of the farmers at heart. If you reject this job, I know that will take it and might possibly cheat your people. I know that's not what you want. And Mr. Wanko, we don't want you to take this job free. If you take it free, there will not be commitment and we will not be able to hold you in case the sharing fails. If you refuse the job, some other person will take it, will be employed to take it. And that's not exactly what the local government chairman wants. He believes in your person. He believes that you are the only person that can supervise the equitable distribution of the fertilizers throughout the whole village. And please see this as a once in a lifetime opportunity to serve your people, the people that you love so much. Oh, Mr. Wanko, do we look for another person? Huh? Oh, that's good. At least now you can easily finance your daughter's university education. Yes, yes. Thank you so much. Love. I know you must have talked to local government chairman. My father I didn't have to do much. The local government chairman saw your father's integrity with his own eyes. So I mean, convincing him wasn't that difficult. Um. Uncle, let me make this personal confession. If you were educated, a lot younger, and willing to live in the city, and I find a man like you, I would propose without a second's hesitation. I um, came very, very close to falling in love with you. This close. Um, but since you and I are evenly yoked, marriage cannot happen. Uh, despite these obvious reasons, 
I think you are indeed a lovable man, despite your cantankerous nature. <laughs> uh, full of bravery and integrity, and a man any woman can count on. I pray that you find a wife who will really love you and take away the pains that your first wife caused. I also pray that uh, you find it in your heart to forgive her so that her soul can rest in peace. Son, uh, actually, I don't know. I don't know how to explain the kind of feelings I have. But I know I have good feelings. Yes, I do. Or since I can't explain it, I did before. So. But maybe God will help me and uh, help me to forget. <laughs> you know? uh, but I wish things were, 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 were different. Honestly, we would have been singing another tune now. You understand? <laughs> but um, I wish you were in my because okay. God will guide you and lead you wherever you can. Uh, one more favor. Can um, Shadika please come with me and live with me in the city? I'll make sure she reads her books, she will attend lectures, and then she will sit for her university examination. You want to go to the city? Please. All right. <laughs> but there's, there's a condition, I thank you. On the condition that you have to be coming to frequently to see me. Oh, we will go together. Sorry. I'm <laughs> not